sometimes that ambulance that we take for granted um, comes at a great cost. Um, sometimes it's very easy to take it for granted because when you call, it always shows up. Mm -hmm. um, and and that, that comes at a, at a high price. All of us can say, you know, all of us that are working, you know, we can say, oh, I had an off day today. You know, I wasn't, you know, I had one of those days where I just really wasn't all, the, you know, it just wasn't my day. Uh, first responders like yourself can't really have days like that because you're dealing with lives in your hands. I mean, you you can have a bad day. You can have a bad call, but you better have a short memory because yeah. the next call is coming. Um, so these guys, they, they got to be incredibly resilient, disciplined, um, and, and task orientated because you don't get a lot of time to sit and process a bad day or a bad moment. You, you got to move to the next one and then, you know, have these healthy systems in place so you can process those things later. responders you don't know from day to day uh, you never know from day to day what you're gonna be walking in on it's unpredictable and, and because it's unpredictable again it just raises that level of responsibility you don't know if you're going to treat a pediatric patient today so but you better be ready to um, you don't know if you're gonna go to a multi casualty car accident but you better be ready to um, so because you don't know what's coming you you have to be prepared in every asset of your job at every moment because you don't know what's coming How is a person that, that, that sees trauma and things all the time, how do you not take that home? You do take it home. You know, we, you have to. At some point, you gotta talk to somebody. Um, and, and what's important is having a balance between talking to fellow EMS providers, because those are really the only people in this world who will understand you. Um, and, but then also talking to people who are not EMS, because those are the people uh, that ground you to your humanity. couldn't ask for a better group of people to do this with. Um, it, it's an absolute honor uh, to lead them and watch them grow as people and individuals and, um, you know, and, and all the other first responders out there. Just, you know, please take care of yourself. No one's walking this line by themselves. <laughs>